Hello everyone, you are welcome to solve this nice exponential equation, which is 4 to the power of a, this is equal to 400. What is the value of a, given that a is not equal to 0? So let's prevent the solution from here. So we have 4 to the power of a, this is equal to 400. To solve for the value of a here, we introduce logarithm on both sides. So we have log 4 to the power of a, this is equal to log 400. You find that log 4 to the power of a, this is in the form of log a to the power of n, which we can express as n log a. Applying this logarithm property or this power rule property, then log 4 to the power of a becomes a log 4. This is equal to log 400 from here. So the next step is to divide both sides by rock 4, here by rock 4. So let's simplify rock 4 and rock 4 from here so that now a is equal to rock 400 divided by rock 4. Now we can express 400 basically as 100 times 4. So let's substitute 400 with 100 times 4, so that now a is equal to rock. This is 100 times 4 divided by rock 4. So you find that rock 100 times 4, this is in the form of rock a times b, which we can express as rock a plus rock b. Now, applying this logarithm property from here, then we have that a is equal to rog 100 divided by rog 4 plus this is rog 4 divided by rog 4. So let's divide rog 4 and rog 4 here. This is 1. So we have that a is equal to 1 plus rock 100 divided by rock 4. So we can express 100 basically as 25 times 4. So substituting 100 with 25 times 4, therefore we have that A is equal to 1 plus, this is rock 25 times 4, everything here divided by rock 4. So you find that rock 25 times 4, this is in the form of rock a times b, which we can express as rock a plus rock b. Applying this logarithm property here, we have that a is equal to 1 plus rock 25 divided by rock 4, then Plus here we have rock 4 divided by rock 4. So the next step is to simplify here. Rock 4 and rock 4 simplifies. So this is equal to 1. So that now a is equal to 1 plus 1. This is equal to 2 plus rock 25 divided by rock 4. So we have that we can express 25. This is the same thing as 5 to the power of 2, and we can express 4. This is the same thing as 2 to the power of 2. So we have that a is equal to 2 plus rock 25, which is rock 5 to the power of 2, divided by rock 4, which is rock 2 to the power of 2. So you find that rock 5 to the power of 2, this is in the form of rock a to the power of n, which we can express as n rock a. Applying this power rule property, then we have that a is equal to 2 plus rock 2 to the power, that is rock 5 to the power of 2 becomes 2 rock 5 divided by rock 2 to the power of 2, which is 2 rock 2. So we can simplify 2 and 2 here, so that now rock 5 divided by rock 2, this is in the form of rock a divided by rock b 
which can be expressed as log a to base b. So let's apply this logarithm property from here so that now a is equal to 2 plus this is log 5 to base 2. Now this is the value of a so that now the next step from here is to verify that this value of a satisfies the equation as follows. Now let's verify that a which is equal to 2 plus log 5 to base 2 actually satisfies the equation. Now if you recall we have that 4 to the power of a this is equal to 400. This is supposed to give us a value of 400. Let's substitute the value of a so that now we have 4 to the power of 2 plus log 5 to base 2. This is supposed to give us a value of 400. So we have that 4 to the power of 2 plus log 5 to base 2. This is in the form of a to the power of n plus m, which we can express as a to the power of n times a to the power of m. Now, applying this exponent property, then here we have 4 to the power of 2 times 4 to the power of rho, 5 to base 2. This is supposed to give us a value of 400. So, from here, we have that 4 to the power of 2. This is equal to 16. So, here we have 16 times 4 to the power of rho, 5 to base 2. This is supposed to give us a value of 400. So the next step from here, we have that 4 can be expressed as 2 to the power of 2. So this implies that here we have 16 times, this is 2 to the power of 2, log 5 to base 2. This is supposed to give us a value of 400. So, 2 to power 2, log 5 to base 2, we find that this 2 is a power. So, this implies that here we have 16 times 2 to the power of log 5 to the power of 2 to base 2. This is supposed to give us a value of 400 from here. So, we have 2 raised to power of 5 squared to base 2. This is in the form of a to the power of log b to base a, which essentially is supposed to give us a value of b. So let's apply this logarithm property so that now 2 to the power of rho 5 squared to base 2, this is equal to 5 squared and this is equal to 25. Let's substitute 25 here so that now we have 16 times 25. This is supposed to give us a value of 400. So we have 16 times 25. This is 6 times 5, which is 30, 0, 3. 1 times 5 plus 3, this is 8. 6 times 2, this is 12, 31. 1 times 2 plus 1, this is 3. So that now, here we have 8 plus 2, this is 10, 31. Here we have 400. So we have that 400 is equal to 400. So this implies that the left add side is equal to the right add side. And this implies that the value of A, which is equal to 2 plus rho 5 to base 2, actually satisfies the equation. So can you refer the steps? Like this video and subscribe. Like this video and subscribe. See you in the next video. Bye bye.